Hi everyone, the Spider-Man here. Well, as you can see everyone, this is my other large female in my collection. This is my Prohigi Lacollis. Fantastic uh, adult female uh, mantis. And um, I have a large roach in here, one of them American roaches. So yeah, I'm just going to um, put the roach in and let her hunt itself. I prefer to do it that way more natural for them yeah and you can see her in all her beauty she's doing really really well never uh, shown me any th um, threat posture um, I remember a couple of weeks ago my eldest daughter she wanted to hold her and when she did she decided to try and bite her finger and uh, we all know that mantis do uh, recognize their owners and she's never um, shown me any threat posture because I'm her owner. So yeah, while I'm here everyone, let's take the lid off and uh, give her a feed. Here goes everyone. So I've put the roach in, let's just quickly just put the lid on because them roaches are really, really fast. And I can see the roach is just at the uh, back of the enclosure there. This enclosure is perfectly fine for her. There's plenty of room in there. And as I said, she's an adult female, so she's not going to go any bigger. And uh, as everybody knows, mantis have absolute excellent eyesight. And she's seen him. So the, uh, the hunt begins, everyone. It's not nice for a mantis to show you a threat posture, but if she did, she would actually spread out her wings and uh, the colour is supposed to be absolutely beautiful. So yeah, once she sees it, I'll uh, then she comes down towards her mail, I'll press record everyone. There everyone, I think she's seen it, the roach is just there, look. Oh, here we go. She missed her first attack there, guys. We'll do a nice close-up of her. Or she's still trying to hunt her prey. It'll take a little bit of time, but uh, hopefully we'll get an attack soon, guys. Just giving her one of her legs a clean. <laughs> there you go, everyone. We have an attack at last. We've only had to wait about an hour. <laughs> but uh, I don't mind. So, you know, I've been waiting all that long for an attack with that plant in and as soon as I took the plant out she uh, grabbed her meal straight away and as you can see she's tucking into her meal I would lift up the lid but she's hanging off the net I don't really want to disturb her too much So yeah, once she's eaten half of her meal, I'll get back to you guys. And there you go everyone. She's eaten nearly half of it already. And she's just eating 
part of the leg there. I've just put um, a light right next to the enclosure on the right hand side and there's one just above as well. So you can get a decent, uh, decent bit of footage for you guys. I can't actually film the whole of the feeding in normal time as I haven't really got much memory left on my iPhone and plus the app that I use to put all the parts together. It only allows me to do 10 minutes of footage. The app won't let me do any more than that. And I think it would take her longer than... Oops, sorry, out of focus here. I think it would take me longer than... 10 minutes for, to film her eat of the whole of her food. It would take a, a lot longer than that. So yeah, she's took into it nicely and I'll get back to you soon, everyone. So everyone, there you go. I thought I'd stop the time lapse just there and let you see the last part in natural time. It's just a shame there's no zoom on the actual time lapse. That'd be absolutely fantastic if there was. Um, I'm not too sure if there was a uh, zoom on the iPhone 7, on the new iPhone 7, I'm not too sure. Because that's the camera I'll be getting Hopefully this year. If there's anybody that's got the iPhone 7. And if they can tell me if there's any zoom option on the time lapse. I'll be appreciated. So she's eating the last little part of her meal. Oh, she's dropped it on the floor. So it looks like the grooming... We'll start very shortly. Here goes. So yeah, looks like she really enjoyed that meal, everyone. I hope the time lapse was okay for you guys. I apologise if it wasn't brilliant. So yeah, I'll leave her to finish grooming. As it's very fascinating to see. She's never ever shown me any threat posture. Only my daughter. <laughs> but like I said, uh, mantis do recognise their owners. So yeah, I'll leave her to finish off grooming. And uh, thanks for watching everyone.